हेलो ऑल एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल माय नेम इज चंद्रमणि पांडे एंड थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर वाचिंग माय अदर वीडियोस विद दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू लॉन्च अ न्यू सीरीज फोकस्ड ऑन मैनेजिंग माइक्रोसॉफ्ट 365 एप्स फॉर एंटरप्राइज यूजिंग इंट्यून थ्रू आउट दिस सीरीज आई विल कवर द एंड टू एंड मैनेजमेंट ऑफ माइक्रोसॉफ्ट थ्री एप्लीकेशंस including how to create and deploy them exploring various methods for patching or updating these microsoft 365 application for enterprise with intune and in the last i will demonstrate how to generate a microsoft 365 patching or update reports using powershell this series will emphasize managing microsoft 365 applications for enterprise in a production environment let's get started beginning with a simple approach to deploying microsoft 365 applications using microsoft intune portal so right now i am on my client machine let me log into the intune portal and then we have to go to the apps and within apps we have to select the windows application and then we have to click on the add application and then within application we have to select the microsoft 365 for windows 10 and later and then click on select and now here we have to update the name so for now i am going to deploy excel so that's why i am going to change it to excel and then language is en us and same thing i am going to update in the description section let me copy and edit the description and here we have to update it click okay and now if you want you can change the category for now i am going to add a category called install application this is my custom category and if you want you can also add some notes for now i am going to click on next now in the configure app suits the very first setting is to configure the configuration setting format we have two options either we can use the configuration designer to configure it or we can also use the xml data traditionally we are using the xml data so if you have any xml data to configure the format you can use it and if you click on that you just need to provide the xml format let me show you i have a xml data in my download folder let me open this and just copy this and paste this file and click on next now we can see that it automatically configure each and everything based on the xml file but because for now for this demo purpose i am going to use the configuration designer so let me switch back to the configuration designer and then we have to select the office application which we want to deploy we have word excel powerpoint publisher access for now i am going to only select excel and then we have also have an some license application like visio and project so i suggest you to create a separate application for each visio and project that's why i'm not going to add here and then what architecture you want so let me go with the 64 bit and then we have to select the default file format let me select the office open document format and then you can also select the update channel so we have current channel preview monthly enterprise channel semi annual enterprise channel and semi annual enterprise channel preview so i am going to select the monthly enterprise channel and if you want you can also use remove the older version so whenever you are deploying this application if any other version is already installed intune is going to first uninstall the application and then going to install the enterprise channel version of office 365 you can also specify the latest version or specific version so for now for the demo purpose i am going to show you a specific version because then in the future video i can show you how we can upgrade this application using the intune and uh, but if you want you can also go ahead and uh, use the latest version and in production environment i suggest you to use the latest version and then do you want to use shared computer activation 
yes or no based on your requirement and then accept the microsoft software license terms on behalf of users it is also selected as yes go with the default setting and i don't want to install the bing and then you have to select the language so let me select the english language if you want you can select some other language it is going to install the other language pack so and click on next and then click on next and in the assignment you have to select either the deployment as an required mode or as an available mode for now i am going to select as an available mode so let me click on add group and then i have already created a for excel let me search that group microsoft 365 excel application in us and select and click on next and click on create now you can see that you have successfully created a microsoft 365 application for excel deployment in enus language now after some time we can see that the application is visible in the in portal let me click on that and now we can install the application let me click on install and now it is started downloading the content and now after some time we can see that the microsoft 365 app for enterprise application is now installed on the test device i hope this is an informative video for you thank you very much for watching this video